Today, both Radovan Karadzic, his legal advisors and the prosecution have been invited to make submissions on the way this trial can continue, given Radovan Karadzic's continued refusal to attend the trial in the previous two weeks. The judges have warned him explicitly that he will have to face consequences if he continues to obstruct the trial, and this is what they will be discussing today, including the possibility of imposing counsel upon him as well as continuing in his absence. A procedural hearing is simply not an evidentiary hearing, so no evidence will be presented, but again, the parties will make submissions in accordance with the, the allowances of the rules and the statute of the tribunal in the ways the trial can proceed. Again, while the statute of the tribunal allows for the right of the accused to be tried in his presence or for the right of the accused to self-represent himself should he wish to, this is not an absolute right. So these rules um, are amendable, if you will, and they can be applied in order to suit the interests of justice.